SCM presents Top 10 Most Expensive Cars. Hi, once again, CJ from SCM. What we have here is a list of the top 10 most expensive cars sold at a public auction from around the world. Yes, some cars have sold more privately, but we're currently unable to get the exact figures. For this list, we should be excluding auction fees, as these don't reflect the true value of the car. And finally, it will be in good old British pound notes, so the numbers may sound a little bit random. Number 10. 1954 Ferrari 375 Ferrari 375 plus Spider Competizione was built purely for use by the Ferrari Works racing team of a 4.9 litre V12 mounted in the front. It finished second at the Mille Mugila in 1954 with Umberto Maggioli at the wheel. The car topped £14 million at the Goodwood Festival speed sale in 2014. Number 9 1961 Ferrari 250 GT A true barn find, this Ferrari 250 GT short wheelbase California Spider was intended for an eventual museum exhibit by the owner Robert Ballion, but it whiled away for the years of a collection of over a hundred other cars. When 59 of these cars eventually went to auction, this Ferrari blew away the competition, and its £14.2 million price tag went a hell of a long way towards the £20 million total generated by the auction at the Arctreo in Paris in 2015. Number 8. 1939 Alfa Romeo 8C This gorgeous Alfa Romeo 8C 2900B Lungo Spider by Touring changed hands at the 2016 RM7 Boys Monterey Auction. The Lungo Spider is arguably the Italian definition of the Grand Tourer. Big, comfortable and surprisingly practical. Complete with a 2.9 litre straight 8 engine with dual supercharging, this particular 8C is one of only 12 Touring Spiders to ever have existed. It sold for a total of £15.2 million. The car's chassis has also been comprehensively researched by Simon Moore in a book calling it The Immortal 2.9. Number 7 1955 Jaguar D-Type This gleaming Jaguar D-Type muscled its way into the top 10 after the 2016 auction at Monterey. It was the first production D-Type with the chassis number XKD50 and ended up winning the 1956 24 Hours of Le Mans. The car ended up selling for more than £16.7 million. It is finished in Scottish blue with white stripes and roundels as part of the Ecure Ecos team colours. Number 6. 1964 Ferrari 275 GTB This Ferrari 275 GTB C Speciale finished by Scaglietti is even rarer than the fabled 250 GTO. It's one of only three Ferrari models that were built by the Marinello Marquis in late 1964 and early 1965 to homologate its new 275 GTB race car. The Ferrari 275 GTB was designed and built to challenge the Ford GT40 and the Shelby Cobra Daytona at Le Mans in 1965. It fetched a staggering £20.3 million in 2015 and was the first Ferrari to ever feature independent rear suspension and represented the evolution of the successful 250 series cars including the iconic 250 GTO. Number 5 1967 Ferrari 275 GTB4 The fully restored Ferrari 275 GTB4 NERT Spider was one of only 10 in the world and had detailed history including an appearance with Steve McQueen in the film The Thomas Crown Affair. The Nart Spiders were a brainchild of the importer Luigi Cinetti who recognised the desire for open top sports cars in the American market. The car sold for £21.1 million in 2013. Also, Luigi requested that the series of assertable 275 GTBs from Enzo Ferrari that carried the familiar NERT badge, that's North American Racing Team, on the rear of the car. Number 4 1956 Ferrari 290mm The X Works Ferrari 290mm sold a New York City setting the records for the most expensive car sold at 2015. The most expensive car ever sold in New York City and the most expensive car RM Boys has ever sold. It was built for Jean Manuel Fangio to race in the 1956 Mila Miglia and went on to distinguish a career afterwards. 
is one of only four of its kind in existence and is attached to the names of Alfonso de Portugal and Wolfgang von Trips, who raced the car through his lifetime. The car fetched £21.5 million in 2015, making it the first most expensive Ferrari ever sold at auction. Number 3 1954 Mercedes Benz W196. This Mercedes Benz W196 Grand Prix car was driven by five time Formula One world champion Joe Manuel Fangio. The car was sold in authentic condition, with visible blemishes and a thin layer of grime as it just rolled off the track. That helped it to a £22.7 million sale price at the Goodwood Festival of Speed in 2013. So you pay all that money and they don't even run it through a car wash for you. Number 2 1957 Ferrari 355 Sport The impossibly curvy Ferrari 355 Sport by Scaglietti pictured here has a racing history as long as your arm and that's responsible for its place on this list. From a first race in the Serberg 12 hours through the Milan Migliale and eventually Le Mans, this car has done it all. This Fezza sold for £27.4 million in 2016 but due to the euro pound exchange rates, its position on this list is somewhat contended, but it's a worthy contender nonetheless. And at number 1, 1962 Ferrari 250 GTO. A lot of you would have seen this coming. Yes, this is the 1962 Ferrari 250 GTO Berlinetta, and it is the most expensive car ever sold at a public auction. Well, for now that is. It was built to contest the 1963 FIA World GT Championships and the 250 GTOs won that year as well as the following 1963 event. Only 39 250 GTOs were built by Ferrari and this particular 62-63 example is one of the best maintained and most race of them all. The price? £29.3 million. This was in 2014 though, so what's it worth now? Who knows? So what do you think of our top 10 list? Are you feeling a little poor? Or are you looking at family and friends and looking at them thinking, how much could I sell them for medical experiments? But not to worry, because just remember, you can always play Forza. Oh, and just another thing to add, if you have any ideas of what lists you'd like to see on this SCN channel or any other videos, please leave a comment or message on the inbox or let us know on Facebook. This is CJ and you have been watching SCN. And as with all YouTube videos, if you like this video, please like, comment and subscribe for more. Thanks for watching and I'll catch y'all later.